Once upon a time, there existed a giant tree that was the source of mana. A war, however, caused this tree to wither away, and a hero's life was sacrificed in order to take its place. Grieving over the loss, the goddess disappeared unto the heavens. The goddess left the angels with this edict. You must wake me, for if I should sleep, the world shall be destroyed. The angels bore the Chosen One, who headed towards the tower that reached up unto the heavens. And that marked the beginning of the regeneration of the world. Lloyd Irving, wake up! Lloyd! Ugh. How do you manage to sleep standing? Oh, Professor Rain, it, is class over? Ugh, never mind. Let's have someone else answer the question. Genus, how about you? Yes, Rain. Mythos the hero brought about the end of the ancient war in the holy ground of Carlon. Correct. Afterwards, Mythos the hero formed a pact with the goddess Martel to seal away the Desions whom caused the war. But the Desions came back and are now causing everyone to suffer. We covered that in class last time, remember? When the seal weakens, the designs reappear, just like they have now. I... Uh, yeah, I knew that. I, I just forgot. Today is the day of prophecy. It is a very important day, which the Chosen of Mana will receive an oracle from the goddess Martel. Now Chosen One, Colette. Yes, ma'am? Tell us about the journey of world regeneration. It is a journey to seal the designs. Upon passing the trials of the goddess Martel, the summoned spirits that protect the world awaken, and mana is restored. Correct. I suppose we should expect the Chosen herself to know the answer to that one. Mana depletion is the cause of the current food shortages and droughts. It is said that this occurs because the designs consume vast amounts of mana in their human ranches. The Chosen's journey has two purposes, to revive mana, as well as defeat the Desions. Now, for the next question. <sighs> Who's that? That's... Settle down. It would seem that the time for the Oracle has come.